everybody, we're back. Day two, Fort Myers Home Show, April 7th. It's the spring show going on right now. And you know what? I'm sitting here with Jake from Bax Max. And let me tell you, we're next to you. Right? And I'm watching these people come up to you, and you can tell they're, they're all hunched over, and they're hurting, they're barely walking right. And they're trying this product on, and they're walking away with big old smiles. Yeah. So let's, let's talk about the Bax Max. Well, the back, it's back Max has actually been around for probably around 10 years now. Okay. It actually um, is out of Michigan. Okay. And I was confronted about four or five years ago by a guy and asked me, because of my background is nutrition, um, asked me if I wanted to sell this product. Okay. And uh, talked me into it. And I've enjoyed it because it's um, really helping a lot of people. Right. Very lightweight. It's only about four and a half to five ounces. They come in different sizes from small to extra large. And we also have extensions for those people that are over a 50 waist. And most people can't find a back support that will fit no, and they actually cannot. do that. That's right. The cords are actually made of Kevlar, which they make bulletproof vests out of. Okay. Right? And they actually have a lifetime warranty from breaking. And the whole belt has a five-year guarantee. It breathes, so down in Florida where I'm at right now, um, I will be headed out late, later to a different states, but right. it's it's great for all the people, and there's many, many chiropractors in your area that actually use the product right. and sell it. Yeah, you know, I ha I mean, I'm a, a fellow back sufferer. I, my L5, L4 are damaged permanently, So, um, and I have, I have a brace. I don't wear it because I'm a sweaty mess when I'm done with it. It's like... It's just dripping wet. It's horrible. Yeah. So yeah. I've, I've noticed this, and when we tried, I tried it on next to you, and it felt good. Yeah. It was a breeze. It didn't, and I didn't feel like I'm going to sit there and be sweaty for the rest of the day by wearing it. Absolutely. Some people actually say that they feel like they have helium in their body when they put it on because all the weight literally comes right up off that whole lumbar so area. So it's like almost like being on an inversion table. Yes, absolutely. That is absolutely yeah. phenomenal. And, you know, how long has the product been around? About 10 years. Oh, so it's got legs. Yes. It's, it's not like it's a flash in the pan and oh, it no. just came out two years ago no. and everybody's trying to sell them, sell them, sell them. Yeah. They, they, they've got staying power. Okay, so let me ask this. Where, if, if I wanted to order one of these, yeah. where do I get it at? Well, you can email me at jakesbacksmaxsupport.com. Okay. Um, you can also um, uh, call me. My number is 419-409-6098. All I would need to know is your size, and we can go from there. That's absolutely phenomenal. So, hey, look, if you're a fellow back sufferer and you got those problems, you need to get online, you need to call Jake, get yourself a back max, and you're all set, right? Yes, absolutely. All right, well, you know what? I'm going to go find myself another victim because everybody's almost scared to get over here and talk yeah. to us, but yeah. we make it fun. And yeah. it's, I, I try at least. So yeah. Can I, I say one more thing? Sure, absolutely. Uh, some I have a, a tent that I actually put up, and it says the world's best back support at the top. Yes. What's so, so funny is so many people will come to me with a back support on and really want to know well, why is yours better? How can you say that? And what I do is just tell them, I'm going to let you tell me once you put it on. Right. They start to take their back support off. And I said, I'll be fair with you. Leave it right on. I put it right over top of theirs. Nine out of ten people will buy it because all of a sudden they feel something they did not get with their back support. Over theirs? Over theirs. And they... And they they that's, can tell. That's amazing. Most back supports you put on your body, all you do is you're squeezing your whole body yeah. tight, trying to get lift. Yeah. Well, this yeah. actually lifts in the back. Exactly. And it's not really tight in the front. Exactly. Hold on one second. We Hold on. Uh, yeah, so uh, that's, I mean, to me, if you can do, if you put that on over an existing, that is amazing. Yeah. It is the world's best. It is the world's best. World's best. You heard it here. <laughs> So, Bax Max. So call this gentleman and get your backs feeling better with yeah. Bax Max. Bax Max, right? Right. All right. There you go. All right. Thank we'll you. talk to you guys later. All right. Bye. Hi, good morning. Welcome to WeBeam TV. I am Delyn Gaston and we are at the Orlando Home Show. And I have with me a guest this morning, Melissa Klassen from Blue Zone Realty International. And she is a realtor and vacation rental 
uh, person, and I'm very excited from Costa Rica, all the way from Costa Rica, although, welcome, Melissa, first of all. Thank you so much, Jalen. <laughs> it's a pleasure to be on your show. Thanks. So um, I do notice that um, you're from Costa Rica. However, that is not a Costa Rican <laughs> accent I hear. <laughs> you're absolutely right. Where did you come from? Well, I'm in the real northern state called Canada. Wow. Um, actually from Western Canada. And uh, my husband and I moved out here. Oh, my goodness. It's been 13 years already. To Costa Rica. To Costa Rica. We nice. caught what I call, we caught the Costa Rican bug and we ended up um, just changing our entire life and making a brand new one in Costa Rica in um, Manuel Antonio uh, area of Costa Rica. So how exciting is that? So you did, I think, what so many people dream about doing, right? Just, okay, we're done with the cold. We finished all this, except most of them get all the way to Florida and stop. You kept right on going and you went down to Costa Rica. How nice. And obviously no regrets. No regrets. How can you when you wake up every morning and it's gorgeous, right? You know, it is true. And that is one of the big things is I, I guess maybe if you live in the States, um, Florida is a southern state to come to and enjoy, but for for us in Canada, in Western Canada, it was it was uh, got a little cold most of the year. So a little, a little, <laughs> a little, exactly. Well, we had I, I always said you could count on the last week of July and the first week of August for perfect weather. <laughs> and that's about it. <laughs> and huh? That was it. Wow. But, but no, um, we did. We came and and actually it was the very first trip. We fell in love and we ended up purchasing a condo. People thought we were crazy, but we knew in our hearts that um, we we wanted to live part of, we wanted to now move on to another place. And as soon as we were in Costa Rica, by, by the second week, we knew that we had found our place to um, have the, the next part of our lives and um, nice. continue working. And it's, uh, and here we are today. So um, does your husband work in the business with you? Yes. He so, does. Well, he absolutely That's does. Nice. So he, um, kind of funny, he's kind of the glue of it all. He handles nice. all of the administration, the accounting. Nice. Um, he, he lets me do what I do, um, which is... Uh, show these gorgeous homes. Show the such. gorgeous homes, be with people. Um, and also, well, we started, actually, we started our business in vacation rentals. Okay. Back in 2006. And then uh, now we do both, which is vacation rentals and real estate. So, nice. Yes. Nice. So we have these lovely uh, Costa Rican mugs here. And I noticed, so you have a sloth. I didn't realize that mm -hmm. they that's where they live. They so sure tell do. us a little bit about the Costa Rica and what's there. And besides beautiful beaches, tell us a little bit more about about the area about the area well it's incredibly diverse okay so there is actually a place just south of us where there's more flora and fauna than any other part of the world oh, and wow. so you're getting all of the various um, bromeliads and plants and nice. amazing fruit and vegetables uh but you're uh, and and the animals are just absolutely incredible we have three kinds of monkeys the white-faced capuchins, the titi, the monotitis, which are these little sweet brown monkeys, and then the howler monkeys, which sound like bears. Nice. Uh, we have the two and the three-toed sloths, and we have all kinds of iguanas, uh, scarlet macaws. Nice. So very, very beautiful, lush green uh, all year long. And parks and things like that that you can just wander through and see these animals. We do. And, and the parks nice. are protected. So uh, people can't build too close. Okay. Uh, and they allow so many people in per day to, to make sure that the habitat stays intact. And so, yes, animals are a big priority in Costa Rica. So there's something, so there's a lot more to it than just where they allow you when you get off the cruise ships and such and the, and the touristy areas. There's obviously a lot more to it. Tell me a little bit about the, um, well, you were able to go down there and, and work and things like that. But what about the cost of living and everything? Mm -hmm. um, um, absolutely. So if you want to work and start a business in Costa Rica, um, you absolutely can, and uh, they it, it's it's very friendly, and they make it easy nice. for you. So the cost of living, depending on what you're looking at, um, is very affordable. So, for example, property management. 
or property taxes, I should say, a quarter of 1% of what you purchase. So when you compare that to oh. property taxes in the United States or even Canada, um, you're paying a lot less. Right, if you're a lot less. A lot less. If you're purchasing fr fruit and um, a lot of the local produce, it's mm -hmm. a lot less as well. Oh, nice. So, um, so it's yeah. very reasonable then. So what's the primary language? Does somebody have to be bilingual? <laughs> you really don't. I mean, it is a lot more fun if you uh, try to pick up some Spanish. <laughs> okay. Uh, I always say I speak really good Spanglish. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, it's uh, so Spanish and, and English. Uh, oh, in yeah. the tourism industry, in the real estate industry, you're going to get people speaking both languages or speaking English. So uh, you really don't need to know Spanish to come and live here and have a thriving business. Nice. Well, this is like so interesting and so exciting. So um, let's talk because I know we're running out of time, but I want to talk about the properties and then the rentals and such. So for somebody who just wants to come for vacation rentals, they can reach out to you. And I know that they have your phone number and your email and stuff on um, up on the screen. So what what can they expect as far as I mean, do you do just um, small hotels up to large families? So we manage a beautiful seven bedroom home that comes with a chef, Ooh. a concierge, cleaning daily. It's kind of like being at a brand name resort, but not feeling that. Wow. In, I, I want to say Manuel Antonio, Costa Rica. So you fly into Coast, uh, San Jose. Okay. And then it's a two and a half hour drive south. You can also fly. There are um, small charters for about $80 from San Jose to Capos. And then you're just 10 minutes from Manuel Antonio, or you can head a little south and go to Dominical or Uvita. I represent all of those areas. Oh, nice. Also some beautiful five-star condominiums, very close to the Manuel Antonio National Park, which is the number one park in Costa Rica. Nice. And you mentioned the beaches, and yes, the beaches are phenomenal. Yeah, mm -hmm. I know. I've, I'm, I'm in love with the pictures. I was also very surprised to see how very reasonably priced some of these homes are, yeah. you know, very reasonably, 15 acres, you know, 15 acres on this, and this gorgeous, you know, um, home that huge and it's, um, under a half a million dollars. That's mm -hmm. just, you know, that would be probably a couple of million, you know, here in Florida. Um, so you're absolutely right. There are, there's something for everyone. So whether you want to purchase land and build later, mm -hmm whether you want to purchase a condo, what I call lock and leave so that someone can rent it out for you. You can make a, a very nice, nice ROI right? and be here part of the time, send your friends and family and have someone like myself manage and rent it for you uh, or a home where we manage that or you come and live in full time. But anything from 49000 all the way to 8.4 million is the range of properties that I have. So nice. Uh, so absolutely. there is something for everyone. So if you are thinking about it, that second home or just relocating and starting life over again in a beautiful, wonderful place, make sure you reach out to Melissa and she is happy to help you uh, make those arrangements. Thank you so much for being with us. Thank you so much. <laughs> I want to say Pura Vida, which is our, our saying, which means pure life there. Nice. And I hope, Dylan, you come and visit us really soon. I want to too. <laughs> you are so welcome. And some hints to my husband. <laughs> I definitely will see you very soon. And thank you so much thank again. Thank you. Thank you. And we will be right back at the home show. Hey, everybody. We're back here at the Fort Myers Home Show. We are talking to Jack. And Jack has got some cool stuff for your windows. So in, let me get this right. So instead of me having to put all this money into putting glass in i can actually pick your product put it on there and be just as safe in essence yes uh, i have to put a caveat in there and which i say this product is not for everyone but for those of us that have basic builder grade glass in their homes right our options are replacing them with an upper graded uh, window or using an alternative uh, option shutters are sometimes an option but most of these things you have to activate you've got to buy permits for some of them you even have to pay each each year for the permit. Wow. My product, which I found amazing, and it was one of the reasons I bought it initially, was they came in, they showed the strength features of the product. The product has been tested to over 180 mile an hour wind factor. And the product has passed all four and all large impact tests. So I talk about 
what the product is, right. not what the product isn't. And it can be applied over an existing house over a two-day period and go from totally unprotected to totally protected in that time frame. And the greatest part about it is we protect what matters most, both home and family, and we don't break the bank. So I'm seeing here that you have a clear option and a tint option. Correct. Is that correct? Yes. Uh, first of all, all of our film are, is 99% UV ray protective. And if you're in a commercial environment, just that very factor can increase your work productivity. Secondarily, we have a range of different uh, tints that when applied on a whole house basis of uh, Florida has determined we can save up to 20% in utility bills. So we also have decorative film and we have specialty films. So we pretty much do the whole range of window film plus window replacements. So some, I'm, I'm reading here some of the benefits is it strings in your glass, protects from break in smash and grab, which I think we have, we have to have some videos that he might be running over there. It blocks 99% of the sun's UV. It's cost effective. Life, limited lifetime warranty, and you got a clear, a frost, reflective, and tinted. That's, that's We've huge. We've even improved it. We've even improved it. We've recently taken on a line of film that has a lifetime warranty. The wow. Limited, the limited apply to the use of certain cleaning materials. The new company, uh, there is no restriction. It is a lifetime warranty. So this product pretty much speaks for itself. It's inexpensive, it's extremely strong, it's got a lifetime warranty, and it even comes with a certain amount of interest-free financing. So between now and the hurricane season, this product is trying to be sold as diligently as it can by the manufacturer, and we're supporting it, and we're going out and we're investigating, looking at windows, and if your windows qualify, we will discuss the product with you. Excellent, now where do people find you at there, Jack? Well. You can go to our website, which is www.glassguard.net, our Facebook page, which is GlassGuard, or you can call us at 239-313-0803. And you're, you're ready to go. We're, so if they call, you the, they call you today or tomorrow, you have a crew out there next week? Well, we're out to see somebody normally within two days, and we're Excellent. normally installing within the next five. That's just, that's like... That's like, that's like putting a warm, fuzzy blanket around you, especially because now the hurricane season, it's coming. It's time. You better get prepared now. You just discussed the time of my life that was maybe one of the most unsettling. It was when I I had only been in business a year or so, and we got hit with Irma, and I was getting phone calls, and all these phone calls were two to three weeks prior saying, can you get in and help me? <laughs> and yeah. what I'm saying to everybody now is if you have any desire to look at to investigate and possibly purchase this product. Please don't wait till the last minute. We're capable now with our crews to handle everybody within a week, and we do it with appreciation. We are also a proud supporter of Songs and Stories for Soldiers, which is a excellent foundation off of Sanibel benefiting veterans. Jack, thanks for stopping by the booth and having an interview with me. And hey, so what do you think about the home show so far? I've been doing shows for many, many years. And what I find is there is always an inspiration in people coming through that don't know what you have that you can explain to them. And the amazement in their eyes is what keeps me going because that turns into a sale. And my product helps people. I don't have to mislead. I don't have to lie. I simply state the facts. And if they're interested, we provide it. And we have about a 96% total satisfaction. Rate. Absolutely phenomenal. Jack, once again, again thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you for it. having us. Hey, we'll be back after this. All right, we're back here at the March 2019 Tampa Home Show. I've got Dylan here with me. And he, if you, well, you can't see below the table, which I'm not sure if it's a good or a bad thing, but he ain't got no clothes on. <laughs> He's just in his underwear, for goodness sakes. And, there, and the whole thing was, is don't get caught with your pants down. So tell these people at home, Dylan, what you do. Well, another part of it is I was told this interview would be from the waist up, so I didn't know I had to wear pants. Sure, <laughs> sure, sure. So, John, what we find is that one in three Americans, they aren't prepared for retirement. So our motto is don't get caught with your pants down, like John will be, it sounds like. Yeah, we, we, have, a, we have a show that's called 62 Who Knew, mm -hmm. and I never realized how much our lives change at 62 years old. Oh, yeah, we find that with a lot of different people that – 
their lives change, they're not quite prepared for it. That's why we're out here. Uh, we specialize in comprehensive planning, so you can be prepared for all those changes that are coming up. Okay, so that does that is that in the insurance side or just the financial side? Oh, it's on it's on all sides. We specialize oh. in all seven key areas of financial planning, whether it be cash flow management, college planning, retirement planning, tax planning, state planning, r investments, and risk management. See, now that's what you need because you know what? At 62, your world's going to change, right? Yep. That's that magic number that go. You're like, you're like, oh my, this is not good. Right. Yeah. So, so tell me more about fi uh, Florida Financial Advisors. So, Florida Financial Advisors, we are local here in Tampa. We're located over in the Hyde Park neighborhood, so just about <laughs> ten minutes away from here. Uh, we have a beautiful new office over there, so come by and check us out. Uh, everyone's welcome for a free complimentary consultation. Our office is dog friendly, and we have beer in the fridge. So, you have beer in the fridge? Oh, see, that's how it is. You get them drunk. <laughs> and then you sign your life away. No, I'm just kidding. I do not do that. Okay. Invest responsibly. Invest responsibly. Hey, you know what? I guess a good investment here lately would be a uh, do-yourself uh, uh, brewery. Yeah. Because they're popping up everywhere. Everywhere in Tampa. Yeah. So, see, so you build it, make it big, sell it, give it to him, give him your money. He'll he'll put it in the right places, and you'll be okay. So, how do how do people get a hold of you? Well, you can get a hold of us through our website, FloridaFA.com, or you can call up our office, Vicki. She's a very nice woman. She'll answer the phone for you. We can set up an appointment. Her phone number is 813-333-1683. And what's the website? FloridaFA.com. All right, so if you need to get some information about retirement and what you need to be able to retire, you need to call Dylan. Dylan, thanks for being on. The Thank you, John. We appreciate it, and we'll here. be right back after these messages. Okay, hey, we're back at the Fort Myers Home Show. Still day one. That's pretty good. Of two days of oh my. Yep. Uh, it's, it's, it's just a lot of oh my. There's a lot of cool products here. So I'm here with Peter. Peter, you have the hot tub store and Hydra hot tubs and pool. Correct. So um, now I'm. I mean, you know, you always think that a hot tub is a hot tub is a hot tub, right? But there's two different hot tubs here oh yeah right and i'm looking at yours and a very distinct difference i love the fact that um let's just jump on the first thing that i noticed that is the tops right they're not the typical vinyl or that fake leather or plastic top yours is actually a true poly right so the biggest the biggest complaint in the spa industry bar none is the vinyl covers they fall apart after two or three years you have to buy a new one Prior to buying a new one, they're heavy, they smell, they're waterlogged, they're right. disgusting. So 12 years ago, um, they came up with the hard cover. The nice thing about it, not just the cover, the whole tub is polyethylene. Right. Kayaks and floating docks are made of polyethylene. Yeah, exactly. And they, they last forever. They last forever. They don't discolor, they don't fade, they don't crack. So we eliminate a lot of the the problems that you have with, with regular acrylic hot tubs. Um, you know, whether it's a cold climate or whether it's Florida where we've got the sun and the humidity, right. does nothing to it. Does okay. nothing to it. I, I take, and they're absolutely gorgeous. I love the fact that you have, you know, I'm looking at a great one here right now, and it's got like a, uh, a faux brick. Right. So it's not just a square piece of wood right. like you're, not, you're used to seeing. You know, it's funny. I, I find when people come in the booth and look at our hot tubs, some people fall in love with them. They right. have no interest in looking in an acrylic hot tub. Right. And occasionally someone will say, ah, I don't really like the look of it. And that and that's okay. Right. That's okay. There's a lot of acrylic hot tubs in the industry. I'm pretty much alone with right. the polyethylene. Right. So for me, as a sales guy, to be able to say, everyone else looks like this, and I look like this, and I'm totally different, Incredibly powerful. Now, it, it, now inside the water, is it, is it still bromine or? So we, when we do a show like this, we include an ozonator with every tub, oh, okay. water purification right. system. You're cutting down either your chlorine or bromine by seventy percent. Wow. So much easier. That and, and it's probably easier to take care of. Oh, then. way easier, way easier. Okay, it's like it's like it's like the difference in having a chlorine pool and a saltwater pool. Absolutely, absolutely. Because right, we have a saltwater pool. I mean, and we are from Florida, yep. and the first thing that uh, I did when we bought our house is I I changed the I went from chlorine 
to the the Hayward or the, the T9 right. cell, right? And it, and it made the water softer, right? And, and it's easier, it's less oh, work. Oh my God, it's yeah, just a little salt. The in beauty every now of it and is and the yeah. less work. That's what everyone wants is less work. Okay, so now you're not just in the Fort Myers, even though we're in the Fort Myers Home Show, you're more than just Fort Myers. Right, I'm the distributor for the whole Southeast U.S. Florida, Georgia, the Carolinas. Wow. I have a store in South Carolina, and we have a place in Boynton Beach, Florida, also. Okay, now you we were talking about um, hot tub here versus hot tubs in the Carolinas totally different right it is you know the Carolinas it's really much bigger in the Carolinas and the reason I say that South Florida especially you know a lot of people have in-ground pools and in turn they have in-ground spas it's right. much more about the aesthetics of it whereas the Carolinas there is some of the in-ground pools and spas but right. the reality is you can't use a, a pool year-round in the Carolinas so people, in turn, the, the above-ground hot tubs are much more popular Okay. There. And and you're more than just hot tubs, though. You do pools, I right? I do pools also. Yeah, you know, yep. installs. We do it all. Fixing them. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. yeah the whole nine I yards. Do, we do service on pools and spas. We sell pools and spas, absolutely. Um, the last five years, business has taken off. I mean, they we started our business here in Florida, and we did shows all over Florida, and it expanded as the years went. And now we're pools, spas, and and the whole southeast. Ah, brother, that is absolutely phenomenal. Now, is it a family business? You know, my son's in the business. When it's not family, <laughs> I've got three partners who are all in the Carolinas. Okay. Um, Rod and Jason and Clay are in the Carolinas. I'm here in Florida. I'm back and forth. Back and forth. Um, and my son's in the business, but that's the only family in the business. Okay, so what's 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 the big boy spas that are moving right now for you? So, you know what? Funny enough, when I do a show like this, my smallest tub, a TT150, which is a 150-gallon spa, that's the most popular. And Two-person? Per- two two-person. A two-person. Two-person. And the reason I say that, a lot of people that have owned a hot tub, they, the first time around, they get a very large tub. Oh, yeah. Second time well, around, they tend to downsize yes. because most of the time, two people use the tub. So I would say the, the two-person is my most popular, and then followed by the six-person, the 650 right. is my second most popular tub. Okay, very cool. So, okay, so if you're local around here, where can we find you? So you can find me at hydrahottubspools.com okay. or the thehottubloft.com, but you'll see me at a lot of home shows. We do shows in... Uh, anywhere from St. Pete to West Palm Beach, Orlando, Tampa, Fort Myers. So we are all over the place. Okay. Um, you know, and when you come out and see us at a show, we save you some money. Right. We've got really good discounts at home shows. So the best time to go buy one is to go home. Go Absolutely. To a home show. Absolutely. All right. Is there a phone number that we can get? Absolutely. Five six one, five four two, fifty one eighty, and uh, I'm proud of my product enough that you'll know that's my that's my personal cell phone. Wow. So you can always reach me, whether it's to purchase something or if you if you need some help or anything like that, you're more than welcome to give That's me a call. That's absolutely phenomenal. And the name of the, what's okay? So you have a, you have a couple of brands, but what's the brand that you really tough spas? Tough spas, right? And, and they look tough. And they so, are, and they are absolutely. Well, Peter, thank Pleasure. you for letting me drag you out of your absolutely. booth. Absolutely. I mean, you're always covered up over there, and I've been watching. I've been watching both of you over here. I'm going. All right, I'm going to get one of them eventually because. I need to get you guys to be interviewed. So uh, thanks for stopping by or letting me drag you by. We'll be back after I find my next victim here at the home show. All right, everybody. Boss Tech back here on the floor, the 2019 September Central Florida Home Show and Expo. It's it's a mouthful. Oh, my gosh. We got a little bit of reggae music going on in the background, but we found John Madison from John Madison Landscape Incorporated. Now, you guys, I'm looking at what you do, and this is pretty that's pretty badass. I like it. So let me tell me, tell me a little bit about your company. Uh, we're a design build firm right here in Central Florida, located right by the airport in Belle Isle. So locally owned and operated, been in business for 18 years. Um, it's kind of from the nuts and bolts we do from the landscape design all the way through to the maintenance, depending on what area that, of Central Florida you live in. Okay. So now is this something you've done your whole life? Pretty much since 14. <laughs> so about as long as I can remember, or as tall enough to push a lawnmower. Oh, so you were the long guy. You're the kid walking with the lawnmower going, can I cut your grass? Uh, the typical suburb boy's story. Awesome. Now, what all do you do? I mean, do you, do you take them from conception to finished product, or do you go in and fix other people's mistakes that they should have never hired? <laughs> well, we don't like to go in and critique other people's problems. Now We, we understand. <laughs> yeah, we, we'll, we'll, we'll fix a problem if it's there. But, yeah, we're, our main thing is, is people call us right from the get-go, um, come in, rip out the old 
put in new hardscapes, softscapes, you, know, you name it, really, structures. Now, I'm sitting under a, is this called pergola? pergola yeah, yeah. Okay, so is this something you guys will, will uh, put in the concept? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, we put okay. lots of pergolas, arbors. Water features, uh, lighting. I mean, so we're standing on something right now. This is what I was going to ask you. This is, I know this is for the home show itself, but is this something that people put in their in their uh, designs? Oh, yeah, this is very popular. It's extremely popular on the West Coast. It's kind of uh, definitely caught in a trend over here on the East Coast. But the artificial turf with the tiles in the middle, it's a very rich, high-end look. Um, and now with the system that we have, it's it's cost effective compared to what it used to be. So it's still not cheap, but it's half the price of what it was two years ago. Okay. Um, and and I'm, I'm looking at all the, the plants. I, I'm, they look real. I, they, they, so you have the ability to just to, from a dirt lot to just fabulous. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. But usually we're coming in and ripping out the old. You know, we don't work with builders and new construction. We're the guy that comes in and we deal straight with a homeowner and we just, okay, what is your dream? What do you want? And then we do that and some. Okay. So where can people find you if they're, if they live in this area? Oh, are we? And that, which I'm central Florida. Absolutely. Obviously come to the show. Um, we're pretty much every home show there is here in Orlando. Um, we're also on, on Facebook, some high, very heavy uh, traffic for us. Um, and then we get a lot of referrals from next door, um, your Facebook, social media from your neighborhoods. I always tell people get referrals. You know, if it, we get a lot of referrals, but they can also, we have an office if someone wants to come and make sure that we are a legit business. Right. And we have actually staff that answers the phone when you call, makes appointments, things like that. Um, we've, we're, we're at that point where we are that established and we have been for quite some time, but we're right here in Belle Isle, right, right by Lake Conway. So, close All right. so, so, okay, let, let's, let's set this, where's, what's the perimeter that you work into and don't, won't go beyond. So going North, um, which is East on I-4 is Sanford. Um, and then we go as far South as North, North Kissimmee. So we don't we go to three, four, seven, four, four, three, four, seven, four, one. Those are the two zip codes we service in Kissimmee. We do St. Cloud. We do a lot of work in Lake Nona, Windermere, Winter Garden. Those are the real booming areas. Mm -hmm. So you got a lot of people moving in from out of state, out of town to those two areas specifically. So that's been a very heavy concentration of our business for the last like three years. But we do a lot of business downtown Orlando. I mean, you name it. You know, we're, we're, yeah, we've been there. All right, everybody. If you're looking for a new landscape design or a new landscape landscape design, maybe you bought that new house. There's really nothing there. John Madison's the man to call. We'll see you guys in a little bit. All right, everybody, we're back out here on the showroom floor. I'm here with Jamin. Jamin, yes. How you doing? So tell me about Martin Epoxy. Well, Martin Epoxy started about 17 years ago. Uh, started out just learning to do floor installation. Uh, I had a passion to start my own business, wanted to make more money, and uh, it led into doing a, a home, home store show where we did uh, tile, wood, carpet, everything. And then later on, uh, we got interested in epoxy. So that really took a turn for the better. And that's all, the last seven years of our business been all epoxy. Okay, so I'm looking down at the floor, and I know, I know I'm a camera guy, I can get around here and get all this stuff. Now, th it looks almost confetti-like. So is, is, does this go over, or do you have to bring everything up off the floors to put it down? Yes, well, this is a coating system. It's not individual tiles, so it's a seamless floor. So what we do is we install a solid epoxy and then we broadcast what he calls looks like a confetti. It's a plastic chips, comes in different sizes and shapes. You know, you got the, the one inch mixed with the quarter inch here and the solid quarter inch, and we can come with any custom colors of your choice. We put a nice top coat over it um, it lasts, we've got a 20 year warranty and a lifetime warranty on it if you do additional top coat. Uh, really good for garage, driveways, uh, really durable, resistant for hot tire pickup, uh, battery acid, and uh, it's UV stable, so the sun will not affect it. Okay, so what's the process? Do we call you, you come out, and you take a look at the, you know, typically there's a garage, is correct, I believe? Yes. Um, and so what's the process? We call you, you guys come out and take care of everything from there? Yes. Well, the process is you'd call us, 
we'd schedule appointments, come out, we'd bring samples to your uh, door, and uh, we would measure it up, give you a price on site. If you decide to go with it, you give us a down payment. Uh, usually it's a one to two day turnaround time. Uh, the following day you could walk on top of the floor. Uh, day three you can drive on it. So it's a pretty simple process um, from start to finish. Okay, so biggest question is, is where do people find you? Uh, they, they call us. Uh, call or text me, my cell phone number, uh, owner, 386-623-5585. Uh, we have uh, our website is martinepoxy.com, martinepoxy.com, or you can text or call me 386-623-5585. All right, everybody, if you want a new garage floor, I'm, I've got my I'm, my brain works a little bit different than everybody else's. I see I see other avenues for this, but if you need this guy, go to his website. We'll put it down below. Call him. Get him out there and have him take And Now, where all do you cover? Do you cover all of the Tampa Bay area? Yes, all Tampa Bay area, basically all north and central Florida. So uh, we've even done uh, commercial jobs. We do commercial flooring, by the way, as far as down as Key West, Florida. So, uh, you know, no, no job too big to small for Martin Epoxy to handle for you. All right, everybody, Martin Epoxy, get your floors covered. All right, everybody, we are back out on the floor here at the 2019 Tampa Bay Home Show, August edition, because it's hot and it's raining outside, it so it's swampy. But in here, it's nice and cool. I'm here with Javier from Easy Grass. Look at this. Now, tell me about Easy Grass. So we're an artificial landscaping company. We've been doing work in South Florida for about 12 years now, and we just ventured out into Central Florida because we had this old territory that we're not really concentrated in. And we saw a need for artificial grass. We do artificial ivy, ponte rubber mulch, grass blocks, artificial living walls. So we're not just a grass company. We do a lot more things. I want people to find out that we're not just a one-stop shop. We do many different things. That's why we're here in the home shows. You get our name out there, our brand, and get people more recognized and known more in the Central Florida area. Okay, so I'm standing on artificial long turf, right? Is yes. that what they call this? Artificial grass, synthetic grass, that's what they usually call it. Okay, yeah. so if, if I wanted to have a front yard of this, you guys come in, you pull what I've got up. Tell me about the process of putting this down, because it looks like to me, it, this was, it's be hard. Uh, it's not that hard, just it's, it's a process. We do excavation ourselves, then what we do is we put a geotextile fabric so the weeds won't go out. We do a crushed rock base, two to three inches of a crushed rock base. Then we level it, compact it, about 85, 90% compaction rate. Then we do a thin layer of sand on top, on top to fill up all the gaps. Everything nice and neat and straight and perfect. And compact it about 85, 90%, so that way it's still drainage. So you don't, don't want to have no pull and stuff like that. So it, may, it works just like how regular grass works. And then we'll do a perimeter of cement. Because a lot of companies use uh, nails. And we want away from that because nails could come out and the edging is not continuous. And with the, the cement border, be able to glue the grass down and so the edge is all continuous you won't have no nails sticking out or being able to pull out and rust and that's how they told we, we do the extra mile and we do make sure the job's done right the first time okay so now start to finish i got a quarter of an acre what are we what are we talking about uh that's a pretty big job we usually do an average maybe about a thousand square foot a week but depending on the big job and we could roll out big pieces of grass at once, then we could do a lot quicker. We did a 10,000 square foot job in Vero Beach, and we did that in about two weeks and a half, two weeks in time, because it was all open space, it was very easy for the guys to go in and work, and we did everything fairly quickly. In fields, we do, let's say a 20, 30,000 uh, square foot field in two, three weeks. So the bigger it is, usually the faster we're able to do the installation, the base work, and get everything done quickly. Okay, so how, how, how do people find you online? And how do, I mean, how do we get a hold of you guys to get you guys coming out? We have uh, Instagram, we can get Easy Grass, our website, easygrass.net. You can Google us, we're everywhere, call us, and we'll get an appointment with you, free estimates, so that way it doesn't hurt for us to go over there, show the products, and, and give it a shot. Okay, so looks like to me, if I want a privacy wall around my pool, this is kind of what this product right here is. Yeah, this is an artificial living wall. This is designed in the UK, and this is called a Vista Green. We have this. This is really the higher end product if you want coverage or to cover a wall 
And Miami just is going big with the ivy as well. There's a lot of graffiti going around there. You cover the graffiti and somebody sees that, nobody's going to graffiti on top of it. So it covers that. You have a neighbor that nobody want to see or a uh, chain link fence that you want to have it covered, but still use that chain link fence. We're able to use tire wraps and hide things and be able to move things around to hide air conditioners, you hide pool equipment, uh, electrical boxes. So that's ways you could use this and the IVs to hide things. So, so this product ha and this product and this product handles this, uh, the Florida sun pretty well. It does. The uh, grass has a lifetime warranty, and everything else we have has a a five year warranty. Everything has a UV fire ratings, has everything you need for Florida for interior, interior exterior, and all those aspects. We'll be able to install it and not have an issue. All right, if you're tired of mowing that lawn or weeding the garden or weeding the wall, I don't know how anybody has a weeding wall, but you know, hey, it is what it is. Call these guys. It's easygrass.net. Call these guys. Let them come out and give you a quote on it. You know, I mean, your return on your investment is not only just the money you, you're spending, but it's your time, it's your health, you're not out in the sun getting cancer, all that kind of fun. I, I, I hate throwing the C word in there. You know, I don't want to scare them all death. So um, you guys, you're, ready, you're taking phone calls, ready to go? Ready to go. Call us. We'll be there the same day or the next day. Whenever you need us, we'll be there. All right, everybody. From the showroom. Of the 2019 Tampa Bay Home Show, August edition. I get throw that keep throwing the August edition there. We'll see everybody later. Hi, I am Dylan Gaston, and we are here at the Orlando Home Show with WeBeam TV, and we are streaming live right now. And I have a guest with me, and this is Blake Deal from Florida Homestead Check. Welcome. Thanks for coming, Blake. Thank you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. So Blake, we've been sitting here chatting for the last several minutes because he has the most interesting, I think, one of the most interesting things that can save people money. You know, the home shows are all about, you know, fixing your home or repairing your home or things for the home. Talk about something for the home, Blake. So tell us what Florida Homestead Check is all about because this is really amazing. Thank you. Um, I've been a real estate lawyer for 23 years and uh, I've done a little over 10,000 closings, and I started noticing and doing closings that uh, quite often people uh, had not properly handled their property tax filings. There's a thing called homestead in Florida, mm -hmm. and everybody thinks, oh, I filed for homestead. You filed for my, my March 1st. That's it. There, there's way more to it than that. And Florida has probably the most generous property tax laws in the nation but they're also the most complicated. And I would say 5% of people understand it. Realtors don't understand it. Title agents don't understand it. Mortgage and people don't mortgage understand people it. Mortgage people don't understand what it. I tell, what I tell people is make sure you file for your homestead, just like what you just said. And just touching real light, tell them what a homestead is because I people don't know. Uh, in Florida, if you buy a house and that's where you live, it's your principal residence. That's your homestead. And they can get a tax break. <laughs> yeah, there's all kinds of tax breaks. Um, there's uh, basically, it's called the Save Our Homes Act. It holds down the amount that your assessed value that you pay taxes on can go up each year to 3% or CPI, whichever is less. And we all, most of the realtors and mortgage, but we only tell people about the, the two of them, $25,000 each, the um, homestead um, and the Well, that's one. another way that it saves you money. They're called exemptions and everybody right. knows about the $50,000 standard exactly. exemption. The problem is there's about 29 other ones that everybody that we doesn't know, know about. about. How interesting <laughs> is this? So and the tough part about it is when you go to file, uh, you may not be eligible for an exemption then, but you may become eligible for an exemption later. And how the heck are you going to know when you became eligible for it? That can right. happen because your income changes, because your age changes, your disability status changes, your military status changes. There's a whole list of things. And there's no way. It's like going on a treasure hunt and not even knowing which county the treasure is buried in. Wow. See? Now, um, so let's touch lightly on some of the ones that you were telling me that are just amazing that people can... Um, let's start first with there's a lot of elderly people in the state of Florida. Everybody comes down here and retires. So let's talk about those first. Well, uh, in Florida, if you're over 65 years old and your income drops below and it changes every year, but this year it's $30,174 in the AGI block on your tax return, this magical thing happens. You become eligible for another $50,000 exemption, which will save you about $1,000 a year on your property tax bill. So if your property taxes right now that you're paying are $2,000 a year? 
it'll go down to a thousand dollars a year. Boom! You yeah. just cut your taxes in half on your property taxes. That's amazing, and people don't even know about that one. See, all we talk about, we in the mortgage business, real estate business, is the two tax exemptions, and that's it. We don't know these exist. And neither do people. Well, there's an 800 pound gorilla named portability and uh, everybody the, knows just a little bit about that, but nine out of 10 people don't even file for it. It basically means that you can take the savings that you've accrued between your market or just value, some people call it, and your assessed value, which is held down by that 3% cap. You can take up to 500,000 of that and move it to your next home in Florida. And it's gonna save you 2% of whatever that amount is off of the tax bill on your next home. So we find people all the time that had $500,000 in portability there that they didn't even file for, that when we catch it, they file one form, they get it, and their property tax bill on their next home will be $10,000 a year lower than it would have been if they hadn't spent that $100 for a homestead check. Right, see, <laughs> so so layman's terms that we're just talking about, so my house is the, the county has it assessed at 250000 I sell it for 350000 but before I sell it, I need to have that adjusted, So, and that's the portability that I can... Uh, it is not intuitively obvious. Most people get their and little... And they're not going to tell you about no, this. The county is not going to tell you about this. No, they want... Most people get... The biggest mistake most people make is they get their, their trim notice every August right. that tells you what your value, market value is with the property appraiser, and they see that it's way lower than they know their home is worth, and they think that they're getting away with something. Everybody wants to think they're getting away with something, but you're not. If you sell your home before you fix that, then your property tax bill on your next home in Florida will be whatever that error was multiplied times 2%. So if you're off by $100,000, your property tax bill on your next home will be $2,000 a year higher. Uh -huh. And it can be as high as $10,000 a year. It, it, it's, it's very counterintuitive and, and no one understands it. It, and it's very, like you said, very complicated and hard to understand. So, um, so Blake, our brilliant um, real estate attorney, has um, come up with a program that you designed and you created, and it is called Florida Homestead Check. Yep, and our main product is called a Homestead Check. It's an incredible uh, artificial intelligence software-driven product that is able to, we've built a gigantic database. Uh, we basically have all the information on every property in Florida going back to 2007. It's the equivalent of over 200,000 sets of the Encyclopedia Britannica wow. that's in our database and it's instantly searchable. So uh, a Homestead Check goes in, it takes some information you give us about yourself and your property and then it searches all those databases and it analyzes whether or not you made a mistake, whether or not there's anything to be gained. And it essentially instantaneously gives you back a report that's either green, that means everything's okay. It's yellow, which means you have issues and will tell you how much a year is involved uh, or red. Uh, the difference in yellow and red is if it's yellow, you have a little time to fix it. If it's red, you better jump on it because you're going to permanently lose the savings if you don't fix them by a certain date, usually because someone's in the process of selling their property. Now, as long as um, it gets done prior to the actual sale taking place and, and a closing and you're turning over keys to someone else, is it does it make a difference if the house is listed? Is it like too late? Is there like a window? You only have so much time. Like Homestead, you have to apply for the Homestead before March 1st. You have to own the property by December 31st. This is what I tell people. Yeah. You have to own the property by December 31st and you have to apply for Homestead before March 1st. You're good. You is, got some of it down there. <laughs> is there a window on some of these other exemptions? Well, ideally, okay. you would fix these problems the year before you're going to sell your home. Okay. And the reason is, is if you get unlucky and you get a contract on your home and you end up in a certain time of the year, basically past around September 10th, September 15th, then you're out of luck. You will not be able to fix it if you're selling your home that calendar year. So we highly advise people to just uh, make sure you don't get it that out of whack so that doesn't happen to you. Um, we have a product called Homestead Monitoring, uh, which basically you do your first homestead check is $100, and then you sign up for Homestead Monitoring, and every year after that, it's only $75, and you'll get a link 
an email link that will prompt you to update your information. If your income's changed, your age, we of course keep track of that. And we will identify if you've become eligible for additional exemptions or if your market value has been monkeyed with to where you need to know about it. So there's always someone sitting there watching, making sure that you're taken care of. So for $75 a year, you can sleep at night and know that you're not paying one penny too much in property tax. If you're not doing something like that, then it's up to you every year to check on all this. Right. And no one does. And and no one does because no, no one knows that, that there's a possibility out there. Let me ask you, one of the things that you said is if your income is below 30,000. So a lot of times people will be working, 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 and then they retire. So their income drops down to, I'm just getting social security now and I'm below. So that's a, like a perfect person who needs to check and see if they I can, can save give you money. a more dramatic example. Let's say you've lived in Florida 23 years mm -hmm. and you're 64 years old and you um, filed for homestead a couple of years when you moved here. Sure. And uh, one day the magic day comes, you turn 65. And then a little bit later, uh, you've been in that home for 25 years. Uh, but you're still working, your income's $50,000, and then you retire and your income drops down below $30,174. No horn blows, no bells go off and whistles. You suddenly became completely exempt from paying property tax in Florida if your home has a market value of under $250,000. And you'd have never had any way of knowing that. Did you hear that? Completely exempt, he said. Completely exempt. There are hundreds of thousands of senior citizens in Florida who are taking their hard-earned money, hard-saved money, and paying property taxes when they're completely exempt from having to do so. And again, the county is not going to tell you this because they're collecting your taxes. Well, their attitude is the laws were put in place to help you, right. and it's your responsibility to know them, and it's not their job to make sure that you know all this stuff. Now, I know we're running out of time, but another quick question on that same thing. So what if... Um, we have a husband and wife and again, working or whatever it might be. And one of them passes away and the other one is left with income of less than $30,000. So does it make a difference why the income changed the, you know, no, one, once you're, uh, passes away and we went from a two income household to a one no, income once, household. once the, um, adjusted gross income block on your tax return drops okay. below the magic number, you become eligible for the various exemptions. And there's actually three different income levels for various exemptions. There's all kinds of different exemptions. There's exemptions for disabled people, for uh, spouses of first responders who were killed in the line of duty. I mean, how would you ever know that? Um, it, the list just goes on and on I know and on veterans on. who are, you know, disabled veterans also are um, tax exempt. And, and the disabled veterans one is huge because if you find out that a disabled veteran failed to file for one of these exemptions, mm -hmm. that's the one that you can actually go back and get a retroactive refund as far as four years back for any extra taxes no paid. Way. Yep. That is fantastic. Yep. That is absolutely fantastic. I so like I have all these veterans that I've done VA loans for in the last, you know, couple of years running through my head. I need to like talk to them about this. I, I don't know if they're paying or not. Blake, you have been a pleasure to talk to. Thank you. Very exciting. I wish you the best of luck with this program. Thank I you know so much. I'm going to share it with my clients. Well, if you want to run a homestead check, people. you just go to FloridaHomesteadCheck.com and click on start a homestead check. It's easy. There you go. You guys should do that. Thank you. You're welcome. Nice Thank to you. meet you. All right, everybody, I'm back on the showroom floor. I found Joe. And Joe is with Leaf Filter Gutter Protection. I'm gonna tell you what, if you live in Florida and you have the trash oaks like we have and all the other stuff, you know, up north, you get to clean the, the, the roofs like once a year, maybe twice a year with us. It's like a monthly thing, but they got a product here that will literally fix that. So Joe, tell me about Leaf Filter. Absolutely. So this is Leaf Filter. It's a surgically engineered stainless steel microfilter set inside a vinyl extrusion piece, which goes right on top of your pre-existing gutters. We seal them up. That way you never have to clean your gutters out again. Uh, we have 63 offices nationwide, um, rated number one by Consumer Reports. And again, we're here to help you out with the gutters. If you need gutters, we can do gutters. If you need gutter protection, we can do that as well. So, so this, this never rusts, no matter how much water, even if you're on the salt water? So again, this is surgical grade stainless steel, so it doesn't ru rust and there's no corrosion. Um, one of the nice features about surgical grade stainless steel, that's the same material cardiologists use in hard stents. 
So nothing organic can adhere to it, and it's not corrosive. Yep. All right, so where can people find you? LeafFilter.com. And you'll come out and give them a quote on the house and how to do it and all that kind of fun stuff? Yeah, absolutely. There's no obligation. We'll come out there and give them a free estimate, and those estimates are good for one year. Well, there you go, man. You know, it's, it's, it's made simple right there. Stop cleaning them gutters. Stop getting on the roof and falling down and getting hurt and all that kind of fun stuff. Give these guys a call. We'll be right back on the showroom floor after this.